I think about the impacts of technology on a day-to-day -day basis. Any time that there has been a big revolution, there have been good things and bad things that have come out of it. And I think that's something for us to be quite mindful of because we really don't understand how technology is going to impact society in the future. My role within DeepMind is to make sure that these technologies are used in a way that is both beneficial and that reduces harm. When I look back, my mum has always been a very, very strong influence on me, and she was such a strong believer in the power of science and knowledge to make change and she always pushed me in that direction. And it's quite funny that I've ended up in this role where it's very much that emphasis, but on a much bigger scale. I am the director of Pioneering Responsibly. We're the team that puts ethics into practice. We look across all of the work happening across the company. My team works with research teams and applied teams, making sure that we have the right people trying to anticipate the risks and issues that might come up in the future and thinks about how to mitigate those. We will engage a lot with external experts to get their perspectives on the work that we're doing. For example, with AlphaFold, this phrase was going around that they were solving the building blocks of life. We engaged with over 30 different experts to understand what they thought about what it would mean to release AlphaFold. That's where we start to make sure that we have these holistic understanding of how our work can impact the world. One of our greatest successes is to not have to say no to teams. If you get people thinking about what could go wrong from the very start, by the time they get to the end, they've avoided all of those things. That's a great outcome. Within DeepMind, we do talk about being bold and responsible. We obviously want to transform the way that the world operates in the future, but we want to do it in a way that is responsible. So when my kids ask me when they're older, how were you helping? I'd be able to say the good things that are happening are because we anticipated the risks and we mitigated them. I think that's all I can do.